What is up guys, welcome to today's video. So today I'm gonna to be doing um, like a how-to on primitive catching um, freshwater crayfish. So the only thing I'm gonna be using is a knife. And I'm basically gonna show you how to make a spear that you can catch crayfish with in a creek. Because sometimes the water can be too deep that you can't exactly get them. But the good thing about this is sometimes if the water's too deep you have to use a spear. And you go through the case where the crayfish might have eggs. So I'm basically gonna show you a way that you can catch them but they'll still be alive, they'll still be fine in case they have eggs so you can let them go. All right, so the only thing I'm gonna be using is my phone and my GoPro that I'm gonna have on my head. So that way it'll, I'll be able to get a first person view of when I'm catching them. All right, so before I get into catching the crayfish, make sure you guys go like and subscribe to this video right now and comment down below whether you've used some similar techniques for this or whether you've done, you've done some other ways to catch crayfish. And I'm linked down below whether you guys are outdoor persons, uh, <laughs> outdoor people, or whether you're like city people. And if you want to, you can comment down below another, another way that I should catch crayfish for a video. But yeah, we'll get on. Alrighty, so I've got the GoPro on my head. Oh, I might fold that down a bit. Alright, so I've got that ready. Now what we're going to do is we're going to look for a thin but long stick. That's not going not gonna to snap in half easily. We're going to be able to put a split down it. But yeah. This might work. Alright, so what I've done here is I've cut the tip off. Now I'm just going to grab my knife. And if you can sort of get a split going down the middle. Alright, so I think that'll work there. So we'll split that top bit. Alright. Alright, so what we're doing now is we're just walking along the side of the creek looking for a decent sized crayfish. We don't want to go for any small ones. Yeah, we're just basically going to look in these areas and they'll be out in the open. Alright, so I came up to this cool little water hole and I'm just going to have a scan around the sides and in the middle and just see if I can find any crayfish. Alright, so there was none in that water hole. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep on going up and I'm going to see if I can find the other spots. But I'll get back to you once I find a crayfish. Alright, so we're currently heading off to a new spot because I had a look around that area and there weren't really any crayfish in that area. Like it wasn't kind of the spot for it, but I do know the spot where there are a bunch of them. So I'm heading there now and hopefully we can catch something there. Alright guys, so I've spotted one just down here. I'm not I'm not sure if it'll stay in there. It might be a bit small, but we're gonna give it a go. And then we'll see what happens. Not sure if I have it, but let's see. Alrighty, guys, this is the perfect opportunity. There's a massive one right here. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can catch it. Come on. I think I might have it, guys. Let's see. Look at that. Alright, so as you can see, it got stuck in between here and it's unharmed. Everything on it is still perfectly fine. Alrighty, now we're going to go ahead and remove it. So 
So as you can see, it's just an easy slide. It's perfectly fine. And now if I just grab it, see it's unharmed. Little scratch on the side. But if he did have eggs, we would be able to let him go. Alright, so now we're just going to let this guy go. And as you've seen, I'm able to let him go because he's unharmed. And so he's going to be perfectly fine. And so if he did have eggs under here, then you would let him go so he can breed. But if he didn't, that would be good eating. Just get a little bit of food out of the tail. And yeah. Right, here we go. Let's let him go right here. There he goes. Alright guys, thanks for watching. So that was just a little video on how you can primitively catch crayfish using nothing but sticks in the deep. So I'm, I'm trying to do videos weekly and I'm, I'm doing pretty well so far. But yeah, so please like and subscribe and leave a comment down below whether I should do more videos like this and what ones I should do. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll see you next time.